Good day viewers, and thank you most sincerely for tuning in to Polymer Update TV, the world's first TV network, with a free petrochemicals news show. You are watching the Petrochemical Market Synopsis with me, Claire Jones. It is Tuesday, November 28. Let's start with energy and feedstock news. Crude oil prices fell on Monday as global investors keenly await the outcome of the OPEC Plus Alliance's policy meeting, which was postponed from November 26 to November 30. Brent crude prices fell by 0.26 cents, settling at $80.32 per barrel, while WTI futures decreased by 0.38 cents, settling at $75.16 per barrel. On Monday, OpenSpec naphtha prices declined by $13 per metric ton at $646 per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. Propylene prices were assessed lower on account of weak crude values and dull demand trends in the Asian region on Monday. On Monday, FOB Korea propylene prices were assessed at the $805 to $810 per metric ton levels, a drop of $5 per metric ton from Friday's assessed levels. CFR China propylene prices on Monday were assessed at the $845 to $855 per metric ton levels, a fall of $5 per metric ton from Friday's assessed levels. Ethylene prices remained steady in Asia on Monday. Ethylene and propylene prices were assessed lower in Europe on Monday. Ethylene prices inched lower while propylene prices were assessed stable in the United States on Monday. If you like our video, don't forget to subscribe to our free news channel and like this video by giving us a thumbs up. It motivates us to continue to bring you our free news service on a daily basis. Back to our news. Let's take a look at futures on China Dalian Commodity Exchange for today. On November 28, 2023, LLDP prices are stable at RMB 78.93 per metric ton. PP prices are steady at RMB 74.49 per metric ton. PVC prices are stable at RMB 58.93 per metric ton. MEG prices are lower by RMB 6 per metric ton at RMB 40.53 per metric ton. In plant news, Jiangsu Yencheng Zhongran Chemical has shut its propane dehydrogenation plant for maintenance on November 27, 2023. Further details on duration of the shutdown could not be ascertained. Located at Taixing, Jiangsu in China, the plant has a propylene production capacity of 600,000 metric ton per year. That's all for today. Don't forget to watch our daily news video tomorrow to know more. This is Polymer Update, with me, Claire Jones, from Polymer Update Virtual World. Many thanks for watching.